You know this story. The crack of lightning. A mad genius. An unholy creation. The world, of course, remembers the monster, not the man. And I think that he showed the bodybuilders that there's a whole other way of, in, in as far as size and proportion that you can go. He put the workload on his muscles to make them get to a level to where there were deep cuts, deep striations, and hard work. You know, and that's what his body prevailed. You saw that. And you can't duplicate that. He's the guy that can make a monster looking bodybuilder look small when they stand next to him. And this guy is called the Freak of Fools. It takes a monster to defeat a monster. Whisperings about this guy, in he comes, and I'd never seen nothing like it. He was like a caged animal, like a demon from the depths of the earth. When I remember for two years, I won the, the term championship, <laughs> and now, now I stay with the best bodybuilders of the world with, on one stage. The motivation is to be the best bodybuilder in the world, and my goal is. Uh, to make a good place in the final, to make the top six, and that's my goal. It's hard to pick this guy apart. He's he's basically the freakiest bodybuilder in the show, and it's just a question of whether or not the judges like the freaky size and mass of a Marcus Rule. I mean, he grew so much in a year. He went from eight to 10 in the mass department. Transformation is amazing. It's like the Hulk. He turned into a complete monster. He made everyone look small, even Jake Cutler and Ronnie Coleman. And here comes the biggest man in the contest tonight, 284 pounds, the German giant, Marcus Bruhl. You can feel the earth move when he walks. The judges actually told him he wasn't big enough. And I don't know what they were looking at, but he is the biggest man here tonight.
John Cena next to the most giant freakish man I've ever seen. That's Marcus Rule. You can see him because he's wide as a house. Now, if you look at this particular photo of Paul and Marcus, Marcus doesn't even look human in this photo. I mean, the size of Marcus Rule next to Paul Dillette looks absolutely insane. Another uppercut this year, including Marcus. Can Melvin uppercut the heavyweight champ? Never ever. You're just small Melvin next to me. <laughs> He got everything to be a great bodybuilder, like the genetics and the work ethic. In kilograms, that's about 150 kilograms. He's also six foot one, so this guy was no small bodybuilder. He was absolutely massive. And next to Marcus Rule, he looked like he barely even lifted. I mean, Marcus Rule looks twice as wide as him. <laughs> 